All right, I just uh, tested this tire. It uh, looks to be about 52 pounds on Aki gauge here. And I'm going to go ahead and make my uh, tire declares that I made. Uh, it's just out of a 99 cent valve cast from Harbor Freight. Some inflation needles. That is uh, actually JB welded through the back where the needle puts through the front. Holes for ventilation. All you have to do is just screw it on. I'm going to go ahead and do it in real time so you see exactly how fast these things go down. Uh, it just puts me down from me down to about 18, 20 pounds in about three minutes. So we'll go ahead, and that's at 50 seconds. I put that on on the video, and we'll let that run for a minute. I'll go ahead and I'll do another one. I've got two of them here. This one's not quite as nice as the other one. I kind of jacked up the holes a little bit and it actually deflates a little bit slower. So the better you drill the holes, the uh, better off you'll be. You can drill it straight through if you have a drill press. So you only have to drill twice, well four times really, to make the eight holes. Or I don't have a drill press in my garage. I went ahead and drilled all eight holes manually with the uh, 1 16th inch rigid drill bit. And I'll go ahead and I'll test this tire real quick. And that one's at, it's like 50 pounds on the dot. Two minutes and ten seconds now. I've been going for about a minute and twenty. So we'll let it run to about three and a half minutes, and we'll pull them off and see where they're at. But as you can see, the damn thing is deflating pretty good. And you'll be able to see from this other one a little bit better how it looks now and what it'll look like here in a minute. I guess uh, it's been about two minutes now. I guess I could talk to you about the $10 quick disconnects that I uh, put together and have posted up. And the uh, cheap tricks and fixes. And all it is is a, uh, oh, what is a, uh, a 7 16 inch clevis pin you can get from Lowe's or uh, um, Home Depot. It's about two and a half inch long with some uh, just some basic uh, flat washer and some hitch clips and all you have to really do is just slide the damn thing right through Actually, in three minutes time, we are down to what looks to be 12 and a half pounds. So these things uh, go extremely quick. And I'll end up pump, pumping some more air back in this tire. But uh, this one here has been going about the same amount of time. Let's see if we'll pull this one off. We'll do a quick test on this one also. And that one is about 22 pounds. So like I said, this one deflates a little bit more slowly, and uh, if you do all all these right, you can uh, actually make a set of four of these for three dollars. Or if you want to break it down, each one of the uh, it's about a dollar twenty. Well, no, I take it back. It's about uh, seventy-five cents a piece. But all you do with these uh, quick disconnects here is you're going to slide it straight through the outside with your washer on the butt of the bolt 
and then you just put the clip in on the other side. I don't have any kind of a wash or anything else. But, uh, but yeah, they pull off in about 30 seconds, if that. So that's that.